<laughs> Happy almost last day of 2022, my friends. You know, I was just, uh, I just got done typing something because I had all these random crazy thoughts. Do you ever have random crazy thoughts and you start saying to yourself, man, if anybody knew the random crazy thoughts that I'm thinking right about now, they would think I'm completely cuckoo. Well, it was kind of like that. It wasn't so far off, but I will, I think you'll probably get some at the very least some be bemusement or amusement from it. I said this to myself, self, um, we are all so busy. Well, hey, I didn't, sorry, I didn't get back to you. I was busy. Hey, I, I was going to stop by there, but I just, I've been really busy. Hey, we haven't been in touch, man. I've been so busy and we are all so busy being busy that who has time for anything else? Right? Oh man, I'm so busy. And then you sit there and when you have this quiet time, right? And you're like, <laughs> man, it's pretty quiet out here. I don't have shit to do. And maybe it's because you were too busy to do the things that mattered when they mattered. So just do them right now is my, my words to myself, honestly. Uh, and I share that with you because it's so easy for us to just defer some simple thing. And pretty soon everything gets pushed back. Well, I'm really busy. And then all of a sudden what's happening to all of us right about now, someone we know and love and loved, have loved him or her or even them for years or decades out of our lives. And no matter how many times we've gone, we've, we've gotten in contact and connected with this, these people that have left us, we never got to see them enough. And all of a sudden one day they're gone. One day, sure enough, you and I will be gone. And why should any of us, and why should you walk around with a, man, I woulda, coulda, shoulda, you know, I just, I didn't. And then you have what's called regrets. Just love people in the now. We know there's no cure for death. There's no cure for stupidity either, apparently, but that's a whole different video. There's no cure for death where no one's gonna get out alive, okay? So just forget that right now and know this, that the cure for death, since there's no actual way to get out of it, is to live as much as you can, to love as much as you can, to be in communications with people who for however long we knew, I had to pull over for a second, just too much driving and, and videoing, for however long we knew this person that left us, there's something about that person that touched your heart. And the more that they touched your heart from what they gave and the essence of who they were is the closer you feel in their loss. We're lost. I mean, maybe they're gain. And there's not a day that goes by that I don't think about my mother because my mother taught me I'll make this brief. She taught me everything about love, not by reading me something, but by living it, by living it by example, by being generous, by being patient, by being forgiving, by being unconditionally loving, also knowing how to receive and having all the class, the graciousness and the gratitude in the world. Just put those in your repertoire as I remind myself on the daily to do class graciousness just be gracious oh you know we're all the same and and absolutely be grateful not just by words but by from your heart open your heart this is a new year coming be grateful for what is already on its way to you and it's on its way to you if you're waiting for it to come for you to be grateful keep waiting because it may not make it Okay, so I am so ever grateful for you, 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 uh, let me see, um, yeah, you too. <laughs> I really am because you're what makes life beautiful, not 
any kind of things. There's nothing in the world, in any country or any city or in any place. I don't care how shiny it is. I don't care how many commas are in the dollar amounts. No one can take your place and you matter. And if you're in a space right now when you feel stuck, I'm just shooting this video to share from the heart with you, but I'm gonna also share this with you. I've been working for a very long time on a program and its whole design, its whole purpose is in about getting me, you, and anyone that follows this trail of breadcrumbs, that follows this GPS, that bakes this with this recipe, you'll get unstuck like that and you'll start moving forward. And the way to do that is to begin in here. This is what I was talking about is, and I'll, and I'll finish it up right now, is I was talking about everybody being so busy and busy can be in the mind too. And the net effect, oh, I forgot to tell you about when I was telling you about the basketball players is, um, I'll tell you about that next time. Uh, I wrote that down. There was a, let me put it this way. The net effect is that your imagination and your reality, you can't tell the difference. Your subconscious mind cannot. So just start going into gratitude mode right now. How would you feel? How will you feel when you are the woman, when you are the man that you want to be? How will you feel? Feel that way now. Practice feeling that way over and over and over and you will become that person. And my, my, my series of breadcrumbs, my GPS, my pathway to that freedom place is in getting unstuck, ditching the paralysis, ditching the procrastination, ditching the fears right away. And it's by going into massive action first in here, because before you run out onto the field of battle, you have to have a plan. And so go into massive action right now in your mind. And then once we get that down of know exactly what we're gonna do and it won't go according to plan, don't worry about that, but you will have a plan and you will follow it up with massive, disciplined, relentless action. This defines your 2023. So long for now, I gotta go because I'm living it and I'm sharing it. Thank you so much from the heart.